Was that the best seven dollar purchase or what? Yes. <laughs> it <was> phenomenal. <laughs> I picked up two of these things for seven dollars each. <clears throat> Greatest thing ever. Welcome to the budget bus life. Okay, so I just want to make sure that um, everybody knows that <laughs> you don't have to have a built out school bus decked out to the nines uh, to be functional in here. We actually have absolutely nothing installed. The air mattresses were $7. The battery operated pump was about $9. Uh, we had hot tea this morning from yesterday. I'm charging up from a, uh, like a battery you know, like a portable charger battery. Just uh, plug that into the wall and then you have two laptop charges. That's rendering, it's uh, making a YouTube video right now. Uh, we also borrowed one of these things. It's just uh, like a lithium booster jumper, which uh, has a flashlight and a USB on the side. So I was able to charge my camera, cell phone, and one, actually there's probably more than just one laptop charge in there. And we're good, we're on the road. We will have to stop at some point today and charge those things up. Um, otherwise, yeah, life on the road without a built out school bus. Totally possible. Totally possible. <laughs> uh, let's hit the road. right over here this brightly colored bus it is called the hashtag that PNW bus okay like I said hashtag that PNW bus we're in a town called Washtunka I believe that's how you pronounce it but this <laughs> it's funny because it's right off the main intersection this is the town it's very small Myself and Josh and Cody actually went down this way to get to another place called Palouse Falls. So I didn't even realize it was just a few hundred yards away. Um, so this is just one of those things that for some reason is a place that people visit because of the internet. Um, the, it's really, it's just a school bus. That's it. And I don't know why it is such a thing, but if you look up that hashtag, or if you Google it, um, you, will, you will see this bus. There's really nothing special about it. It's just stripped out. Um, but you'll see this bus all over the place. So um, let's go do a little bus tour. See this? Yeah. This is not the kind of bus. Yo, Mike, is this the kind of bus you want to buy? 100%. <laughs> Everyone should buy this bus. If you want a bus and you want to do a conversion... Yeah. Uh, this is basically the opposite of what you want to purchase. Um, but, uh, you know, we did get some spray paint just because it looks like. Um, I'm just going to take a wild guess and say they don't mind if you spray paint. So I don't normally spray paint things, but I think in this circumstance, um, you know, it works. Things, but uh, not so much of a bus artist. 
at least on this one. All right, we are back on the road. I think we're gonna head towards some hot springs now. I don't know if, uh, if we will make it there in time uh, uh, today, so it might be tomorrow. Also, at some point along this trip through Washington, Idaho, Montana-ish, I'm gonna be hiding that Jergies treasure. So if anybody is uh, up for a road trip or lives in this area, I highly suggest um, keeping uh, a close eye on their videos, uh, the Jergies on uh, YouTube, and uh, you will have a chance to win it. So that's all I gotta say right now. I'm just enjoying the ride. Got Michael way in the back on his uh, $7 inflatable mattress. <laughs> I think he's probably doing another blog post or uh, doing some practice edits with a uh, YouTube video. I think it's called one of those things. It's so beautiful up here. I love it. We got trees everywhere, a big green, blue lake. People are doing water sports out there. Today is what, Sunday? Yeah. Saturday? No, Saturday. Saturday. Today is a Saturday. Um, so yeah, we're just making it through Idaho. Um, we stopped by and we saw um, a friend of Mike's. Uh, this guy who has a, like a small, like a wood, wood burning stove company, like a tiny thing. Um, so we might have a little something for the bus in the future. Uh, we'll see. He's got like a new idea for something. Uh, otherwise, we're just going to make our way east and uh, yeah, we're going to try and find a hot spring. We probably need to uh, charge up our auxiliary battery packs because they're getting a little bit low. Um, we've just got a few more hours of driving through, in my opinion, some of the most beautiful parts of the United States here. The, uh, I think it's the Rocky Mountains of uh, Idaho. 